Look at the front where it says Ames real big. Okay, everybody, we're out here in beautiful, sunny, warm, who the hell am I kidding, Winchester, Virginia. While this is actually a beautiful city out here, very historic old town, full of history, Civil War history, too, that I, I just love. But anyway, um, we're back here today at the Old Toys R Us. You may remember, I did a video here years ago, back in 2018, I did a video here after the company went bankrupt and closed down all of their remaining properties. And uh, this was one of them that was just left cold, dead, and barren, even though it was like 90 degrees when I came out here and did that. And, uh, well, we knew Ollie's took it over a long time ago. Uh, we just haven't had the opportunity to come in here and check it out. And, um, I'll just tell you right now, um, my goal was to do a Halloween video in here, but they don't really have a whole lot of Halloween things at all because I was already in the store and got what I needed because I needed to get windshield wipers, and I'll tell you more about that when I find them in there. But um, I wanted to do a Halloween video, but they didn't really have many Halloween items in there. However, that actually gave me the idea to do a store tour. So instead of just checking out Halloween items, you get to see the whole entire store, basically, uh, and how it compares to, you know, when it was uh, TRU. And uh, fun fact, they even still have the old register lane lights in there from Toys R Us as well. So it's pretty cool. And I know Ollie's has a habit of doing that. Like, there's an old, um, there's an old, uh, Ollie's up in uh, Uniontown, Pennsylvania that took over in Old Hills, which became Ames, and they still use the Ames register lights in there, though I believe they painted them red, unfortunately, but still, it's cool, and I believe one of the signs in there is original to Ames as well, I think it's the restroom sign, but anyway, as this escape goes by me here, let's go inside of TRU slash Ollie's and check out the good deals and good stuff, good stuff, cheap good cheap stuff all right <laughs> really <laughs> <sighs> all right let's go before Kayla kills me from laughter just let it out just let it out <laughs> You know, that's going in the next blooper reel. <laughs> All right, let's go. Look at that. That is awesome. Oh, it's so cool to see Ollie's take over the old TRU. I'm excited. Let's go and check out this old place, which is full of life again. Look at all those TRU cards. That's awesome. They still use them, especially the older ones like that one there. Really cool. And then that one with just the R on it. Very cool. But what are we waiting for? Let's go inside of Ollie's. All right. Let's check it out. We'll go over here. Over here in this section, though, by the front entrance, all the books. Tons of books. They have lots and lots of books here. Really big book section. Uh, up here is typically the buyouts, a lot of whatever. They got a lot of in stock, like toys, like they're getting ready for Christmas, summer stuff, like pole floats. They're trying to get rid of at this point. Lots of toys, though. Great place to get toys for Christmas, I'll say that. Yeah, lots of people in here, too. And Christmas. <laughs> They got Christmas trees are from Target. Go figure. <laughs> I need to get wiper blades though. I got them here a year ago and they actually held up very well considering with how much rain we get up here. I've used them almost every day. To think this was Toys R Us though. Oh good, I just saw the wiper blades. I'll go get them in a moment. Here's the back of the store. Lots of clothes, hangers, paint, rugs. Good looking store. 
Very nice. A lot of carpet. They also have lots of furniture too. And wow, they got TVs. Of course, these are cheap TVs. LG, though, that ain't a bad brand. TCL, I'd run like hell away from it. Uh, let's see. What else? Oh, lots of candles by Yankee Candle. Look at that little shelf. Perfect for like a bathroom. Crazy to think years ago this was full of toys. Then I filmed it when it was, you know, it was abandoned when I did my original video here. And now here I am shopping in here. Huh. Every time I go down, I want to turn down an, an aisle. <laughs> There's somebody, oh, look, old Toys R Us cart too. Still rocking them here. That's cool. Back towards the front. Well, here are all the wiper blades that I had said. And I need 22 and 17. I'm not going to get the real cheap ones. I get the frameless ones like these. I think it was actually this brand because I remember them being $8 when I got them. And they've lasted me a year. So if I see 17, I'll grab one. Uh, I see 18 and 16. Great. <laughs> oh, wait. Here's one here. Okay, good. 17. No, I just need 22. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Look at that. Got what I needed. Perfect. Now the bee friend can see in the rain again. Now I will tell you too. In the past, I have used the Rain X Latitude wiper blades, which are uh, frameless wiper blades like these. They're the ones that are like $25 to $30 a piece. And to be completely honest with you, they don't work any better than these do. These are a fraction of the price and they work just as good. Now, Mine have been on the bee friend for about a, a year, and that's usually the end of their lifespan. But eight dollars versus twenty-five to thirty dollars for the for the Rain-X ones, I'll take these any day of the week. So even though they might be cheap, they might look cheap or whatever, they work very well. And honestly, after using the Rain-X wipers and these for the past year on the bee friend and on the Z24 for that matter, I'd rather just save money and go with these ones right here. Okay, here's another look at the store. I just happened to see these cookies here too. Kayla and I love these cookies. Kayla's mom and dad sent us a bunch of them last Christmas in a uh, like Christmas care package or whatever. Sent a couple packages of these cookies, the regular size ones. These are the mini ones, but they are very, very good. Very good. Anyway, as I was saying about toys, this is your toy warehouse here. I mean, you, you can almost feel the Toys R Us vibe still alive in here with the uh, amount of toys that they have in here. And I know Ollie's bought a lot of buyouts and toys from Toys R Us when they were going out of business. So, oh, here we go. Gardening stuff. Good. We're working on summer 2023. Good job, Ollie's. <laughs> Fantastic. They do have some cool fall stuff here. The Christmas tree, though, thing that, for the candle candle holder 20 bucks I, I, I really like that though we'll be doing Christmas videos here very very soon anyway lots of fall decorations lots of scarecrows too <laughs> nice uh, like that right there you can put a candle right in here it's pretty cool here's a look at the front there's Ollie himself <laughs> This is a great store. They have lots of food up here, too. Lots of candy for trick-or-treating, too. Look at all the trick-or-treat candy they have here. Now it's all off-brands. I'm not the biggest fan of Palmer's candy, but maybe you like it, and that's okay if you do. Ooh, cotton candy. I think I'll surprise Kayla with a bag of Hawaiian Punch Fruit Juicy Red Cotton Candy. That's different. What the heck, I'll surprise her. She's out in the car on the phone, so surprise her and while they don't have a whole lot they do have some electronics here like earbuds chargers cell phone holders antennas brackets for tvs cell phone cases plugs wires all that stuff they do have some not a lot but some anyway 
Oh my god, this. Oh, you should try my product. It's a great pillow. Oh my god, if you ever watch Djibouti dubs, I can't take that seriously anymore. Winter's coming, they have lots of heaters, and if you get hot like me in the middle of winter, you can put an AC and crank out the cold air from outside in, instead of just opening up a window. Um, ooh, wow, I actually kind of want one of these for work. Little mini fridge. I never heard of Hot Point, though. I don't know how good or reputable they are, but it would be nice to have a little one for work. $69.99. Not bad. Now, what I was looking for, and I don't see here, is something else I bought here in the past for the cats. I bought a cat tower here, and they've had it now for about two years, and it's now just starting to, like, get to the end of its lifespan. I just don't know where they have them, so I can show you them, but they had, they had good ones, and I paid a good price on it, and it was pretty tall, too. Just don't know where they have them on display, if they have them on display. I don't think they do. Oh, gosh. Again... Oh, you should buy my pillow. It's a great product. Look at that. They still rock the old Toys R Us checkout lane lights. That's awesome. Still going to use. All right. That's going to wrap it up for here. Boy, that was cool getting to go inside of there after it was uh, Toys R Us, you know, all those years. I mean, just look at the building here. That's, that's so cool. I, I miss Toys R Us, but I'm glad Ollie's moved in because I love that store. And uh, boy, I'll tell you what, seeing the Christmas items in there got me excited. I can't wait to do a Christmas at Ollie's video. Whether I do it at the Shaler one again, or if I go to another one and do it there, I will be doing a Christmas at Ollie's video. And speaking of Christmas, actually, I was so excited. I saw these in there and it was only 79 cents, so I grabbed it. And they're still good. They expire at the end of this month, 1022 anyway. And I mean, geez, it's candy. It ain't going to kill me. <laughs> well, I mean, it could down the road, but got my first candy cane of the year. Thanks, Ollie's. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to wrap up this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Boy, that was fun. I like going in there. I wanted to do a Halloween video, but this ended up being even better because I could give you a store tour and uh, pick up what I needed to get. So hope you enjoyed that. I love going into Ollie's. I love going and doing this store here in the old TRU. But I'm going to take off. We have to head back to Pittsburgh. So thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. Stay awesome. And on Kayla's behalf, have a Toys R Us delicious day, Ollie's delicious day, whatever. Bye, everyone.